Okay, I'm going to be making my second gardening video now. This is the same spot as they planted the snap peas. They didn't come up because the area was too flooded and they didn't grow. So subsequently, I planted some cucumbers over here. And you can see that they're growing now. As you can probably tell by their different sizes, I planted these cucumbers from as seeds, and they grew from that point. So there's no snap peas here, but there are cucumbers. I also planted these pepper seedlings. You can see the cucumbers are coming up all along the spot. Hmm. I didn't plant these tomatoes right here, but here are more of the cucumbers I planted. Again, this is where I planted the snap peas. But at this spot, they didn't come up. You can just see all the, the cucumbers. I did plant these two tomatoes. For some reason, this plant's doing a lot better than that plant, even though they were the same size when I planted them. Hmm. Again, I didn't plant like these tomatoes over here. I did plant snap peas in some other spots that are growing. So here's some of the corn. You can see that too. It's coming up. Okay. Here's the strawberries. You can see them. As I mentioned in the first video, they've been growing this patch for like two years now. Okay. So now I'm going to move to some other spots where I planted the other snap peas. So these are the ever snap peas I planted over here, you can see. Yeah, they're about almost finished because it's almost the end of June. But you can see them in their full glory, I guess. Again, these are cucumbers that were planted as seedlings, but the ones in the black were planted as seeds. I didn't plant those plants either, though. And here are some eggplants that I also didn't plant. Again, basically in this spot, the only thing I planted were the snap peas. And here are some more tomatoes and pots to get better sun. The first spot has the best sunlight, which is why I focused on that. And here are the rest of the snap peas I planted. So you can see. Again, there's also some more stuff in the spot, like cucumbers that were planted from seeds that I didn't plant, and tomatoes. Again, I like the first spot the best because it has the best sunlight, but the way things worked out this year, it seems to have some of the fewer plants. Oh well. Well, that's it for my second garden update.